Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? Your boy Apathy. Today, I'm going to be doing a YouTube video talking about something that happened a day ago that was pretty crazy. But before I get into it, I want to be talking about something else. I think I'm going to start doing a lot of more live comms and shit. You know, just talk about stuff that's happened to me, to me in the past or recently. Crazy stuff, stories, anything like that. I don't know, man. Seems like you guys seem to enjoy it more. Right now, I'm using a CUDA. I actually love this gun. I have been using it a lot in respawn lately. And I don't know. I'm just really liking the, the new update. The recoil is insane. You can map people pretty easy. A lot of you guys can see I'm pretty damn pissed. And you guys are asking why. Why, Anthony? Why are you fucking pissed? Well, a huge reason why I'm pissed is because my last video, the one I did about, you know, G Fuel, my son's addicted to G Fuel. Well, I put a lot of time into it. And I mean a lot of time. I mean about two hours of recording. And then on top of that, about an hour to an hour and a half of editing. So, yes, I'm pretty damn pissed. And on top of that, I paid about $30 for, like, props, like the hat, the... The, like the little stuff and for it to just barely break 2,000 views it, it literally does kind of piss me off I understand it's gonna happen, but then what why do I even try why do I even do those do do those like very insane videos those really hard-working videos? I mean sometimes sure, but why not just do live comms like everybody else so well the funny part is I actually do enjoy doing live comms It's, it's just not that I just want to be original and I want to spice things up and I want to show you make funny videos and show you guys like like originality and then it just Oh, gets me mad, dude. Two, barely 2,000 views. I thought the video was pretty good. I thought I was going to hit at least 5,000. At least. You never know. Maybe it would have done better. No, but hey, Apathy, it's going to barely make 2,000 views. I know you put a, a, th about three hours total time making that one video. And a video that you probably put in 30 minutes to an hour did double that but or triple. But it's okay. It's how YouTube is, buddy. But either way, I'm getting off topic right now. And I'm sorry about that. I'm just genuinely pretty pissed about it. So uh, today I'm gonna be talking about a story that happened to me, a story that was kind of, kind of, was kind of, was kind of crazy, crazy, crazy. As I'm talking about crazy right now. Boop, boop. Boop! Oh, world star! <laughs> so about two days ago, me and Maria had to go to the mall, take some pictures for Santa Claus. You know, we're gonna send some postcards. We do it every year since we started dating. So we finished that. I had to take her to work. You know, we're both kind of hungry. We wanted to eat something. We're thinking about eating at the mall she works at. I was like, you know, we shouldn't. Let's go somewhere nicer, you know, somewhere more more fancy. We ended up going to Olive Garden. I actually love Olive Garden. I barely eat there. I feel like I am not eat there enough. Now, Olive Garden was dominant, man. They got the free salads. They got the freaking free bread. They got pasta, cheesy stuff, pizza stuff. Dude, it's so good. I'm legit. I freaking love Olive Garden, and I will for the rest of my life. So after the... Oh, my God. This kid just fucking world started me. Jesus. So after a dominant meal and we're so it was, it was so good. I'm not gonna lie. I freaking I felt full I felt legit the best feeling in the world. We're heading back to the car I had to take her to work. So obviously, you know, we got to get back into the car You know, I opened her door, you know me Gentlemen open the door real quick. We got in the car and then we started driving this this is another map if you haven't noticed So we get into the car. I'm blasting some Britney Spears, you know, it's going good You know, we dancing we vibing out there. I'm kidding. I wasn't actually why is it me that I always get raped sometimes? I don't get it, dude. I had first shot. Fuck, kid had a god of aim. I wasn't actually blasting Britney Spears. I was blasting Logic, because Logic is the fucking best, and he is the man. So, you know, we're bumping, we're vibing. We're about to head to Expressway, because I need to take her to work. So we're going to take Expressway to get there a little faster. So as we're driving up the ramp to go into the Expressway, you know, we're about to exactly enter the Expressway out of nowhere, literally, because I have my windows down. A big wasp like this, like this size. I'm not even kidding. Flew in. I don't even know what it's doing there, but it decided to fly in and get a go like in front of my dashboard. I mean, I mean, me and him were having a, a staring contest. Like this, this was serious, guys. I'm legit. Like we were like he like eye to eye. This thing is right on my dashboard. A big ass wasp that if I start driving fast and that thing starts attacking me, I'm done. So I tell, I'm like Maria. Like I was, I was kind of panicking. But I knew how to keep composure at the situation. I mean, one, I'm driving. Two, I don't want to cause panic and the wasps to start attacking me. So I just, I kept composure. You know, I was, just, I was breathing in. I, I took a deep breath and I was just waiting. I was waiting and I was like, Maria, Maria, should I stop the car? Should I stop? Should I just stop the car to the right? Like literally, stop the car. You know, like in the lane, in the side lanes, and just. And just work it work with this and, you know i was hesitant like me and her were talking we didn't know what to do should we stop should we not stop and i, I think it got to the point where i was just like fuck it I, I rolled down the windows and i just started speeding up and just kept going but before even that happened i asked maria give me a shoe 
Give me your shoe. This was all serious, guys. We're, we're this is this is life threatening right here. Like this could go from to me driving, getting attacked by a wasp, to like swerving off the road or swerving off the expressway or like hitting someone. So I was like actually legit scared and like worried that something like that was gonna happen. So I just took it one step at a time. So I'm over here driving one hand. I got her shoe in the other hand. I start speeding. Both windows are down. I'm trying to get this thing out the car. I'm ready. I'm ready to start swinging. As I start speeding up and going really into deep into the expressway, out of nowhere it flies up, and it's like coming my way. At this point, my life just. I knew I knew shit was about to go down. Like I knew this moment either shit was about to go down or I was gonna be lucky as fuck. Now luckily I was lucky as fuck. Out of nowhere I see the thing and it just like kind of goes through the window and I guess the window just like phew. But as this is all happening, I have the sand on one hand. I'm driving. I'm like ah, ah. I'm going to town like making sure it's not attacking me. I'm swinging everywhere. And this legit all happened, guys. Like this this is exactly what happened. I'm not even making this up. Like I'm dead ass. Like this was this was very serious. Like I know it's just a wasp, and I but like like if this was anywhere else, if I was just like outside, whatever, walking, it's not a big deal. But the fact that I'm driving and the fact that's in the car and like front of the dashboard where it can e I can easily be attacked. If I'm being attacked, I'm not just gonna like oh keep driving. I'm gonna start like swinging my arms everywhere. I'm gonna lose control of the car. And you know, shit could actually go down, like legit, like shit could actually like something could happen. So yeah guys, I'm not gonna lie, like my heart was beating fast after that. You know, it was very serious and like at the time and the moment, like it was pretty serious. Thank God nothing happened, you know, everything went okay. I didn't want to come back home with like stings all over my body. So thank God. I love you guys. I hope you love me too. This has been your boy Apathy. I hope you enjoyed this cut calm. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Today has been a wonderful day. Hope you guys have one as well. And don't forget, I already said that. Peace out. Chill.